Venison bulgogi, let's go. We need to start out by slicing this very thin. The secret to that is pre-freezing it for about 30 minutes so that it gets a little firm. It's frozen, but not solid, you know? There's still pliability here. This will give us some leniency when we're slicing. The thing with venison, the secret is you wanna get as much sinew, and I do a very good job of this when I'm butchering, but I always do a once over before I cook it and getting any silver skin off or anything along those lines and just throw it away. So right here, this is a connective tissue line bringing two cuts together. It'd be wise to take that out because it is tough and for this bulgogi recipe, it wouldn't render out in time. So I like to trim these out. So this is connective tissue. We want to cut this out and we're just going to slice it against the grain super thin about an eighth of an inch thick not a big deal at all <laughs> look at that oh no chip is the onion just finally chopping it. We're gonna throw it in the blender. This is a pair of pears, you get it? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Bosque pears to be exact. A little bit of ginger. Wait till you hear this thing pulse, baby. It's gonna make you a fart. <laughs> <laughs> That's yes, fart music right there. <laughs> okay, massage this in, this Perinade. Oh, nice. Some brown sugar. A little bit of soy sauce. A little bit of sesame oil. Green onion. stir. Here we have some fermented soybean paste. We all know what this is. The famous goju jong fermented red pepper paste. It's got such a unique smell. A little bit of honey. A little bit of sesame oil. Last but not least, a clove of garlic. Stir it up, dog. Mm. That's good. Freaking good. That's beautiful little barbecue sauce. Samsung. 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 Maybe that's what it's called. They're gonna put straight to Korea now. Turn on. Hey. I'm gonna slice this carrot, stick them into here, and then pour the hot oil over. Snap this shut. That's it. That is years of talent, hard work, dedication, drive, severe hunger. That's what it looks like in a carrot matchstick. Can you cut a carrot like that? Doubt it. Just gonna pour this brine in here and pickle the carrots. Perfect. Snap that baby shut. Let it set at room temp. Bit of oil. Bulgogi means fire. The bull part, I think. And the gogi means meat. So fire meat. Traditionally, it's done over charcoal grill, but also very common to do it in a cast iron or carbon steel skillet. You just want aggressive, hot heat. Quick flash in the pan. Psst, psst, psst. Done. Don't overcrowd the pan. Nice even layer. 
should only take about 30 seconds side slightly brown oh this is perfect oh pretty stir-fry for a white guy oh yeah Lettuce, a little bit of rice, you know, you don't need too much. Some venison, we'll go put two on there, why not? Like that. A little of the barbecue sauce. Oh, a couple pickled carrots. Oh. A bit of cilantro. Oh. Supposed to wrap this as tight as possible into a little package. Joy. It's a perfect bite. Watch. Watch. Woo! Dude, that's good, man. That's good. Venison bulgogi. 10 for 10, delicious. That is a good venison bulgogi. That is the first one I've had and the best one I've had. Wrap it up, wrap it up.